Meow. Moving packets. Hi, this is John from Moving Packets, and I thought I'd show you very quickly something that's been bugging me about Microsoft Word as part of Office for Mac. So this is to do with custom document properties, and I use these to insert fields in my documents for values that are repeated or appear in headers and footers and that kind of thing. So let's set up a property, and the one I use that I've had the problem with is one called date. So we're in custom properties. I'm going to add a new field called date. And for the sake of argument, I'll say it's the value is today, and I'll hit OK. So now let's add this into my document and add a field. Um, I do not pick the built-in property called date because that just puts in today's date. I pick doc property and then use options to choose the custom property I created called date. Hit OK and OK, and it's inserted the value that I set in the field. So, so far, so good. Now what happens when I want to change that date. So I go back to my custom properties, I click on date so that it brings a value up of today, change it to tomorrow, modify, and what does happen there? It's put a field in called date completed with the value of tomorrow and it's left my existing field with the same value. Let's just try this. When I click on date, it auto selects date completed from its list of standard fields from the list above, but it populates the value with the field date. If I actually want to change the value for the date field, I have to go back up to name, delete everything that shouldn't have been there, now change it to tomorrow and click modify and click OK, and then obviously I can update my field. That's kind of annoying, isn't it? Meow. Moving packets.